Hello Loadsters, welcome to day 14 of Load 513. And today, Elaine asked us the question, who? Um, I really took the easy way out of this one. I have about 50 million things I'm doing today. I'm getting ready to go up to Orlando tomorrow. So I am trying to pack what I will need for load and what I will need for the trip and just trying to get it all together before I leave first thing in the morning. So in doing all of that I put my layout off for a bit and then was just really looking for something I could bang out quick but still fit in with the prompt in my way and be cute and something I'm proud to put in my books. So I have uh, this layout from when my sister and Andrew were just here in April and I used the who in the title, look who joined us for breakfast or look who came for breakfast and it was goofy and it was a very funny moment. Um, there's three of us at breakfast so the chair next to me was empty and Andrew told me take your bag off of that chair I bet you one of the characters sits with us and he was so right goofy sat down in the chair next to me and my sister was so busy because they gave us crayons and we were able to draw on the tablecloth and she was so busy drawing her picture that she was focused on that goofy no joke sat there for a solid minute looking at her before Andrew finally had to nudge her and say hey <laughs> and her expression was priceless and I told that very briefly here and I just kept the colors and the tone of the layout very fun and light and cartoony I mean it's goofy and there's that certain playfulness about him so I kept it very simple, very easy, a big title, I focused on the who since that was our prompt, I inked some edges here, I added just a little bit of buttons and bling and a couple of these cute little stickers that they say oh so thrilled and big smiles and I just thought it was a simple but told the story I wanted to tell and captured this very funny moment of their visit so I think I got everything done for today as far as prompt and a layout I'm proud of and a story told that wouldn't have been told otherwise and I hope the same for you I know we are all busy um, we all have things that we have to get done and we have dinners that need to be cooked and laundry that needs to be done and many of you have children that need to be looked after and picked up and do homework with and I honestly don't know how you do it because it takes all I have to not forget to walk my dog but um, it can be done and you could just keep it super simple and super fun and just remember they're your stories and you're going to want to remember them so I hope day 14 finds you all well it has been a fabulous two weeks so far and now we're off for more adventure two more weeks of adventure and I'm so glad you're all joining us and I will see you tomorrow. I am not sure if I will do the video in the morning before I head to Orlando or once I get there so that will be a surprise for all of us and don't forget you could always comment below or drop me a line if you need anything and sign up for the mailing list and I'd be happy to help with any scrapbooking dilemmas you might have or anything you want the scrapper on the street to tackle and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye everyone.